What is going on guys and welcome to ESC Weekly. I am your host Chris and Mr. Epic Games and I am joined by Mariner Gaming. Say what's up. Hi. <laughs> and in today's episode we're going to be talking about the new Black Ops 3 Awakening DLC. So there's going to be five new maps, four of them being uh, online multiplayer maps and the other one being a zombies map. So the first map is Gauntlet which is set in a military environment with snowy lane a jungle lane and an urban lane. So the second map is going to be Splash, yeah, which is set in an abandoned water theme park. Uh, the paths include using slides to move around and underwater combat. So Marinak, if you want to read the next three. Okay, so the third map is going to be Rise. It's going to be like a construction facility. Uh, the developers describe it as like a Call of Duty map that includes a lot of cover to cover uh, based combat. So you know, lots of hide and shit. You bitches, campers, mostly. <laughs> <laughs> um, then we got Skyjacked. Um, it's a remake of like Hijack from Black Ops 2. Um, is it's really all it is. Uh, what I've seen from uh, the trailer, <clears throat> that looks pretty cool. You could literally just jump off the map and just jump right back in under it, because has like this big hole. So it looks pretty cool. Yeah, it's like a big uh, hole that like uh, got blown out. I don't know what vibe, yeah. but it really does look like the Black Ops 2 map hijacked with the boat. I think this is a, sh yeah. a ship now? Yeah. Th that's, what it, that's what it is. It's just a remake of that. Yeah. They, they even said it. But it, what it looks like also is... um. Remember the helicarrier map from Black Ops 2? I don't remember the name. Um, the one that you could always do trick shotting in. Oh. You could just like change the map with the card caster glitch. It's called Carrier. You actually just said yes, it. That's it. You, you said Heli Carrier. <laughs> I I don't remember. I haven't paid attention to the map names. <laughs> I just paid I just paid attention to what they look like. Anyways, so the third, uh, well, it's not uh, not the third map. No, actually, it's not a map for multiplayer at all. This is the zombies map. The best one of them all. Zombies. We got the one who shall not be named by Chris. Yeah. Um, it's called Der Eisendrack. I can't pronounce it. Dracula. Uh, set in a castle. I just moved the shit out of my chair. <laughs> Holy shit. Anyway, it's set in a castle. Uh, Der Eisendrack. It's... Uh, it's the name of the first Black Ops 3 Zombies DLC. Uh, this takes place in a medieval castle set on top. That's spelled wrong. I'm reading and I can't read. <laughs> this takes place in a medieval castle set on top of a very troubling mountain. It's a site for many atrocities. This episode 4 and first chapter in time travel zombie experience will continue throughout the upcoming DLC. I like the uh, emphasis. Change. <laughs> Change so much. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, next we're going to be showing you the Awakening DLC pack preview trailer, and here it is. Put it in perspective, when the DLC comes out for PS4 on February 2nd, 10 days later, the Deadpool movie will be coming out. And another, what, 20 days later, will be the DLC will be released for PC and Xbox One. Yep. And then maybe like a month after that or so, it might be released PS3. Maybe. Yeah, we're not quite sure on that yet. So that's going to be it for this episode, guys. I hope you did enjoy today's episode. And Marinax links will be down in the description down below. Yeah. And hope to see you in the next one. Do it for the love, for the love, yes I do So you don't care about the money, well yes it's true And I'm so blessed to be fulfilling my destiny All